Hey guys, Wombio here and welcome back to Dying Light 2 episode 114 where today we're gonna do the matchmaker and well whatever else you have time for. But the main goal is finishing the matchmaker. So let's go! Well, I'd love to sprint in here, but of course it's not allowed and I also have to fix the brightness on the outside as well. Yeah. Usual stuff. Okay. I ain't leaving the bazaar today. The wind there we go. The east. Okay. And the matchmaker is which way? That way. Oh, we'll go this way then. Right there, we have the matchmaker and the ah, uh, what's it? And then we have the pilot. But what's the other one? That's the pilot, and that is the the job challenge. Yeah. I'm going to see if we can tackle those today, but hey, don't look into how long matchmaker takes us. Yeah. Yeah, not going to make it. Oh well. I was hoping I would be able to climb and jump from one roof to the other, but nope. Matchmaker shouldn't be too far now. Let's make us a question you've already actually tackled. It's not something new like the, 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 the Delity Job Challenge and the Pilot. <laughs> I'm to my bed, but my best to remember these things. Sorry, I'm busy. Grab this, grab that. Now you're busy, I'm also busy. Grab that, grab that, her weapon damage is trash as per usual. Anything here, don't forget the feathers. And don't forget the resin, which is no longer. Hey, Aiden. I thought you were with us. I was with you, but I'm no longer. Yeah. Did everything for the survivors last time. We are now with the PK full on to the end. And climb up, climb through, please. Thank you. You're You know me? Yeah. I was hoping I'd bump into you, actually. Let me introduce myself. I'm Rahim. I run Sparker, the first post apocalyptic dating service. Uh, how does it work? A dating service? Yeah, I could use a little something, something, if you know what I mean. Uh, tell me. Oh, I'll gladly explain. Get you up to speed? Okay, I'll admit it. I made you a card already. Whoa, what? I created a profile for you. A uh, profile on, on a card? What on earth for? Well, it's my job. The world may have ended, and most of our loved ones have turned into bloodthirsty monsters roaming the streets, but uh, that doesn't mean people have stopped being lonely. I mean, shit, that's exactly why they're lonely these days. People weren't lonely before? But you mean to tell me there was a time when people weren't lonely? Imagine a world where people actually went out to work. Shopping, walking their dog, and on top of that, they had dating apps. Um, uh, apps? Okay, okay, never mind. What I'm trying to say is that before the shit hit the fan, we used to socialize. There were parties, you know, where people got together just for the sake of being together. And of course, to get laid. <laughs> Now, everyone just stays home, behind closed doors, because, well, meeting new people can result in getting clubbed in the skull for a bucket of water. And how do you, how do your cards work? So, well, let me get this straight. Your cards help people meet. Basically, yeah. People who want to meet other people come see me. I draw them. I'm pretty good at that, or at least 
but I don't. Then I put their portrait on a card and display it on my dating board. If someone's interested, they get in touch with me and voila, a romance is born. Not always for very long, but uh, I guess that's something that hasn't changed. But right now, I'm in deep shit, and I desperately need help. Uh, of course you do. Some shithead trying to imitate me forged several Sparker cards. They scattered them around town. That's infringement. It's ruining my reputation and disorienting my customers. I need someone to collect these big cards for me and bring them back. I heard that Terrence's hack was killed in a dark zone, so he won't be bothering me again. And I managed to find most of the fake cards. But there are two left I couldn't get hold of. Bring them to me, and I'll give you the card I made for you. Check the map on the wall. I've marked the possible locations for the fake cards. Okay. Where are these cards exactly? Let's track the matchmaker. And we're off! Uh, uh, this way or that way. Yeah, this one's very close. Two cards you couldn't get a hold of. Interesting. And I can jump over that. And I feel like I'm trapped in here. Move! One he couldn't get a hold of. Dead ahead, actually. So the guy that tried to imitate him died in the dark zone. I'm hoping he didn't have one of the cards with him. But I'm knowing us. Uh... Where is this one? <laughs> ah! No, oh, okay. I'm not quite the button I meant to press, but it's all right. Oh. Out of the way. Excuse me, coming through. I don't want to go in here. <laughs> what are you doing in the daytime? What? Uncommon trophies, at least. Oh, oh, what's spotting me now? No mercy! You can't handle this. I was too up there, I think they can challenge me. I did not think those little dogs would come running after me out of the dark zone into the middle of the day. Well, I knew this was coming! Listen, you, you two! Incoming! Follow me insultingly! Get off! Enough of your nonsense. Right, okay, so, that one is in the dark zone, didn't think, think it would be the closest one, but I guess it is, in this case, I have two options, the bazaar, or this windmill over here. Let's go to this windmill over here. Oh boy, let's just get the nightmares done over with. Man, I'm a little low on health. I need to go... Uh, 
lost. This way. Yeah. Yeah. Ay, 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 ay. Okay. So there's no problem. Climb up! Uh, no, one climb here either. Okay. Here we go. Finally. So, we're gonna get over to the windmill and sleep. <laughs> and then, uh, see if we can get this done before nighttime passes. <laughs> Yeah, oh, this ring is way too far from my liking. This ring is way too far from my liking. Damn, this shit is heavy. My curse is going to break, and I don't know what to do about it. Okay, let's sleep. Okay, I don't think I should have healed because not yet, but my health is not full. Wasted in med camp. Oh well. well. That's fine, we're out now in the darkness. Again. Oh, I saw a video of someone running through the central loop with all the volatiles are chasing them, and oh dear me. <laughs> uh, not fun. No, not fun at all. <laughs> okay, light it off. There's one literally on the other side of this thing here. Please, jump over the other other building. Well, actually, don't do that. Yes, go that way. I need to go this way, which... Yikes. Oh, there's one right in there. There's another one right there! Go, just go. <coughs> Worst <coughs> scenario, we run... We turn around and run the other way. Back to the same zone. There you go. What is that? Okay, there's now a volatile right there. Is that a bolter? Also, there's just the on the other side over here. Is that a bolt out? I hit him with a tie knife. Okay, there's another one over there. 
And he's coming this way. It's not quite what I hope. There's another one on that roof there, too. Um... Like he's not just right, 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 right below us. <laughs> he's just casually walking around the same zone. Yeah. <laughs> See any of them over there? There's one guy over there. Make it a zombie! Go away! Got bigger things to stress about than you! Oh boy, you coming by. Yeah, that's what you get for living next to a busy road and trying to be a YouTuber. Oh boy. Uh, there's one right on that roof there as well. Ooh. No! I'm in this safe zone, you can't get me. Uh, like I said, we'll try to do this before the night passes. <laughs> this is too crazy. Like, what's the best option here? I mean, it's the only one I gotta go to, and it's just 100 meters away, but I can't go 100 meters without being spotted. I'm running, I'm running for it. Ow. Get me in here. You shut your mouth. <laughs> oh my days. I'm way too scared for this. Spinner. There's a spinner right there spitting at me. Get back! What's that? What has a view of actually seeing me? That's a viral. I don't care too much. I mean, if I get in here, no one, nothing else can get in here, but then what's already in here with me? So... Get away from me! Huh, I'm basically technically safe. No my rope. We get into a dark zone, we loot it. Oh, what sees me now? Turn around, it's a little. <laughs> That's not actually funny. Uh, oh no. Uh, he's down. Yeah, where did that spinner go, by the way? 
love you. Man, I killed the other spirit and there's another two and more in here. Including the one I just killed and this one is still very much alive. But they're very weak, weak at least. Okay. Let's loot this place clean, shall we? Just 20 minutes later of panic and stress and screaming. Cool. Oh, the music started up again. What sees me now? A regular zombie? Ah. Yeah, let's go! I need to check my throwing net and see how many more I have left. Well, I can see that. I was 60, so we're still okay. Uh, what sees me now? Viral! Sparkle card. Ooh. All the world whiskey and canned food. Okay. Only a moment of time before we're back out into the nightmare again. Oh, there it is. A sparkle card. I know exactly what I was looking for that. Open this, and what's in here? Oh. So, some wristwatches and tools I just keep thinking about what's going on around outside the building. That's all that's in my mind right now. Oh, we can. How much does that actually do? Or does that trigger a regen effect? Nothing really. And there is a room in here with one of those thingamajigs. Uh, what's it called? The crystals? But it's behind this room here, meaning it's over. Man. Now I'm getting flashbacks to the previous episode of How We Fought Barney. I think that has never happened to me before, but that was so brutal, though. Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh, man. That was absolutely insane. Let me loot the rest of the stuff here, you know. We find the Sparta card. Found the Sparta card. Uh, you must at least get all these things, or else it will also be a waste of a night, really. We're here now, why not loot the whole place clean? Just in case. Now, oh, come on, open up. Immunities just below, just below halfway. What am I talking about? It's just above halfway. Uh, oh, found you, found you right here. You are. I think it'll be there somewhere. Ooh, I'll play some better armor and old world manual and a wristwatch. Ooh, old world vodka and some scraps. Okay. Oi, 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 what is in here? What's over here? Oh. Yeah, I'm glad I picked that up. Another uncommon trophy. I'm gonna say step closer to upgrading something. Okay, um. I believe that's. that part over now with. Back into the nightmare we go, huh? Well, actually, staying on the street was actually better for me. No, that go me. Ugh. 
I just need to make a run for it. Oh, there's one right there on my left. Get on the bus. Get up and over, we're good. Oh, okay, go, 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 go. Good, okay. Let me go up and sleep and get end this nightmare. Oh, mommy. Uh, Okay, let's sleep. Oh, mommy, uh, these nights are no joke. Honestly. And it turned out he was one of those guys who knew his way around the dark side. Uh, Motherfuckers won't okay, now we gotta go all the way over that way. At least, hopefully, I can do this in a day. I don't quite remember. It's been such a long time ago that we did matchmaking. I just hope it's not in the dark zone. If so, I will happily run all that way over to the day. In the day, all the way. Oh, I can't speak. Oh my dad, why does this always happen in recordings? I'm trying to say is I'll happily run over there during the day and tackle the thing during the night if necessary. If not, I'll be more than happy happily to stay in the daytime at least. No stress, no screams about any bottles. No, no, no. Oh. If I only knew that that thing there that they was telling me to defeat was a volatile. But it seemed like when I hit it, the other volatiles were not alerted, so... At least that's something, but... This is my current state. I am not able to defeat them. Get back! Oh, I think I chopped, chopped, chopped their head off. Right, isn't this one in the other purse itself, which we already have, it's belonging to the PK, and it's totally safe to go here? Patrol, report in already. And the sparking card is over here on the table. Awesome! Aha! Now I can get my own sparking card. Indeed! We can end this nightmare of the matchmaker. I keep saying matchmaker. Howdy, soldier. Oh, See? You're all tied together. <laughs> right now I gotta go 160 meters this away. Well, I was hoping to get this over with quicker than I thought, but hey, it's okay. 30 minutes on this, especially when we do things in the night, and especially going to take a long time, especially with something like me, I'm saying especially a lot, anyway. Anyway. I gotta remove my marker from the windmill, otherwise that's, that's gonna confuse me at some point. Now, let's take this back around. Awesome! Matchmaker is basically complete. At least we did we did something. <laughs> right then, all done. Right, I found your fake cards. Now let me see what you made me look like. Like the prince you are. Here's your sparkle card. Check it out. Come back here later, if you want to meet the people that liked your Spartan profile. Okay, we'll come back! Basically these Spartan profiles... They do attract you people, and it's like a short big chat. Over here, so it's not like... Major, but anyways... I guess in the next episode we will tackle, I'm curious about the Dirty Job Challenge, so we're going to go tackle that in the next episode. 
But then I think we should have uh, choices. I'm gonna go to where I just was at. Oh, actually, there's a safe house not that far away from it. We tackle the side missions we have left, and then I'm gonna go tackle the uh, what's it? The military airdrops again. I thought he was about to try and slam the building and I was kind of throwing the throwing knife, but anyway. Oh, I'm just gonna grab onto it. Come on, man! <laughs> Did he step onto a trap or something? Wait, no, you gotta be kidding me. Did he throw a throwing knife into the fire hydrant and it exploded on him? <laughs> uh, oh no. And now deadly these things can be. Hello, PK, you're all over this place here. Interesting. They basically reoccupy the military areas, so I didn't know that. Are you even going the right way? I don't even know. I am, sort of. There's a little bit more left. We'll go over there, save our things there, and we're gonna start our next episode from there, hopefully do the Deadly Jump Challenge and the pilot. Because now the challenges are super short, so it shouldn't be an issue. That safe zone's on the bridge. Uh, there should be an easy way out. There's me zombies is sliding on by. Um, there should be a ladder. Let me not confuse myself with Bonnie's hideout. Which it basically is in the same place. <coughs> and then I should find the ladder and then climb up it. Here it is. Climb the ladder, go all the way to that way, and then we should be able to go up over to the safe house itself. <laughs> Grab onto that rope, I'm now here. Okay, we're good. And onto the thin beam, I hate this. Okay. Oh, don't fall off, don't fall off, don't fall off, don't fall off, and go here. Cool, we're here, awesome. Right, the stresses of nighttime is over at least for now. I'm sure there'll be a plenty more things for us to do in the middle of the night, especially over in Old Villador. I mean, the central loop over there in the city. You will fall off now. I'm sure. We'll be running and screaming like crazy over in that side there. Is that the central loop or am I looking the wrong place? I'm um, think I'm things more over that way, right? Yeah, central loop is over that way, not that way. Yeah, that area there. Uh, I'm sure, that, like I said, there'll be more night missions over there too, probably. Not even to mention the GRE anomalies that we still have to tackle as well again. Uh, anyway, like I said, we'll tackle the Deathy Jump Challenge, which is just over here. And then the pilot. Then we'll perhaps go after all the... Military airdrops. And only after that. Then we can perhaps continue, well, begin into the dark, which is the main quest for ours. Which is our chance to escape from here to up there. But I guess we'll have to wait and see what happens 
until then. So, if you guys didn't see the first episode or the previous episode of Dying Light 2, you guys can go to the beginning of the video. There will be two cards popping up there. You can click on those if you are interested. There's also two links in the description. One link will take you to the Dying Light 2 playlist and the other one will take you to my website. If you are interested, they will all be in the very bottom of the description. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please do a like, share it if you really liked it. Comment and subscribe if you wish, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.